Now in this video of WCF, we are going to start discussing a very important scenario that is message exchange patterns. Basically whenever a service and a client communicates, there are n number of XML based messages are passed. And depending on how I want to establish the communication, these message exchange patterns will be in the picture. So far, when we created any method with the operation contract attribute, by default, it was going through the request reply message exchange pattern. So if you will not specify anything, by default, it will be like request and reply. But when you want to specify something different, you have two more options that is one way message exchange and duplex message exchange. So basically one way message exchange is something when so for example you make a request and then you will not wait for the response and this process at your end will be released. But similarly if you want some details out there for example if you are downloading some data and you want to check like how much percent downloading is done so in that particular scenario you can go for the duplex message exchange pattern so in this particular video we are not going to see any particular message exchange pattern as i said like request reply is by default in our next video we'll start discussing about the one way message exchange pattern and then after that we'll also discuss about the duplex so that is all for this particular video